day three of the cruise and we are off to get breakfast in the main dining room. <laughs> the ship is rocking a bit today and I'm feeling a little bit, mm, a little bit queasy, but I'm hoping it's just because I'm hungry and I need to eat food. So we'll see how that goes. The queue at the MDR was very long and it closes in 20 minutes. So we're gonna have to go somewhere else. Is this level five? Oh no. Um, so we're just gonna go to Cafe 270 for some more breakfast burritos. <laughs> got an egg and bacon muffin with tomato sauce and a beef burrito with salsa and sour cream today. They didn't offer it yesterday, so it's a good tip. a performance from a dance school company called In Vogue. We actually um, met Rob and Michelle whose daughter actually organized them to all come on this cruise and perform for us and yeah they did a really cool job. today and I've ordered potato gnocchi and Ben has ordered what did you order? Turkey tenderloins. Turkey tenderloins and I might also try out the salad bar as well because I'm a pig. Just like a side serving really. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Hello. For this one? Yeah. It's this one. Do it. Very good. <laughs> That's fine. That's it. Yeah. From Bali. Oh. See? Beautiful technique. Of course. Look at that. Amazing. We use a uh, pizza cutter. We, yes. Never yeah. seen that before. Yeah. Yeah. They use it only on, uh, in the pizza. That's right. You can also use it in the salad. Salad. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Thank you so much. <laughs> to change the direction we we'll turn to the left with 90 degrees start with your left foot we tap the ground and your right foot going to kick and the turn okay I know some of you may know this already it's a electric slide okay it's very easy so now let's turn back face to the stage start from the top three two one go
we've just been hanging out at um, 270 and we watched the trivia which was okay the questions were a bit weird but then I've just um, done a 70s line dancing for tonight 70s night so yeah I've been boogieing on the dance floor um, got a bit of a sweat on to be honest but yeah now we're going to check out the sexiest man competition on deck 14 so it should be fun it's already started but we should be able to catch the end of it yeah very exciting the weather's a little bit um, it's a bit rainy and stuff and I can feel the humidity now so yeah but we're having a great day so So we have just been at the pub or the, what's the pub called base? No, that's, the <laughs> so we've just been at the pub having a beer and, oh, the Amber Oak, Amber and Oak. And now we are going to head back to 270 because we've got Pixels on tonight, 5.30 and we just want to secure a good spot, I guess. Um, so we'll hang out there have a few more bevies, watch the show, hopefully maybe I can get a little bit of footage from that, they probably don't want us to record it, so, but yeah, um, done a lot of activities today, it's been a really good sea day, and I'm looking forward to the show, a lot of people have said that they've seen it, and they were like, oh wow, it's actually not what we were expecting, but it was really good, so we are definitely looking forward to the show. Pixels that was absolutely mind-blowingly amazing those dancers know how to dance and the production and the, the technology was so good the music the singing everything like seriously come on this come on Ovation and says you definitely have to check it out and now we're hustling to the theatre to go and check out the next show that starts in like 10 minutes. Um, if we miss this then, I don't know, we'll, we'll have to go to the 8.30 and then we miss dinner in the grand or the main restaurant so we're hustling. We're hustling for a seat and then we're going to get drinks and pee and do all that. So yay, good times ahead.
Madam, two things. One, you laugh like a chicken. <laughs> and I'm not picking the eggs up. And two, I don't think you realize who I think I am. <laughs> too hard or too easy for some of you, depending on which side of the intellectual fence you've chosen to sit on through life. <laughs> we, yes, we can count to eight to make a bit more a challenge for the smart Alex. All right? Listen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. Does anyone not understand? <laughs> I don't want to have to slap anyone. I don't mind slapping you though, Roger. That's another show there. <laughs> Without any further ado, thanks so much for coming. Remember, there is an encore, so you know what it is. But right now, right here, no, right here, right now, <laughs> in, the, in the beautiful Royal Theatre aboard the beautiful the Basin of the Seas, in the middle of wherever we are, this is your Wembley! Let's do that again. This is your Wembley! So we are off to the MDR to get some dinner and it's 70s night so I've put what I could find that kind of looks 70s. I know my shoes are, have got it going on but I'm not sure about these earrings but we'll see. Um, I'm hoping I look a little bit 70s. Well you can see my earrings and then there's my shoes. So yeah, dinner and then, oh, drinks, dr dinner, drinks, dancing. Okay, so we ordered at the MDR and we ordered the salt pepper squid, the escargot we're going to share. We're also going to share the, what are we sharing again? Oh, the satay. Yeah. The satay salad. The soup and the satay salad. Oh, and we got escargot. If I did not already say that, that's just come out. Then for mains, we are going to do the duck with hoisin sauce. And the prawns. The prawns. Yeah. And we've held off on the desserts because we're going to see how we feel, but I mean, we ordered a lot of little entrees and main so we'll see I'll see how I feel but I, I'm eyeballing the apple and rhubarb pie so anyway I've currently got some calamari we've got the escargot I might as well do this all right so let's see, shall we? Get a little bit of a sauce, some salad. It is crispy. And the little um, sauce with it, it's very garlicky, but it's good. It's like, yeah, it's good. There's about four pieces, five pieces of calamari. Yum. Oh, it makes me happy. It's time for the S car go again. Let's see how they taste now. Delicious again. So good. Very cheesy, very buttery, garlicky. It's everything you want in a snail. Like, I'm not a snail expert, but I'll pretend I am. <laughs> Onion soup. It's a bit sweeter than I thought it was going to be. And if you don't like melty cheese like I don't, probably just skip over it. Um, it's nice, but I don't know. I like hearty, hearty soup, so it's kind of like, uh, it's a little bit, it's a little bit sweet for my liking. Alright, 
We got the duck. So I'm excited because I, I, it looks like half a duck here. And um, I basically don't eat duck unless I order it at a restaurant. So I'm excited to just taste it. It looks like there's some really juicy gravy on it, served with rice and some, a little bit of veggies underneath. But yeah, all right, here we go. That's so good. Duck with hoisin sauce. Definitely a big tick from Diedaka here. All right, what's your name? Jose, Jose, Jose. Hey everyone, meet Jose. What's your role here? Yeah, uh, supervisor at restaurant. Yeah. He's the man <laughs> of the restaurant. He looks after all the peeps that are going in and out of this restaurant. And um, how how how's this cruise been so far? It's a bit rocky today. A little rocky, but fantastic. Do you have a, you have a, lot, a, great time. a lot of sick people on board? Today? Uh, no, 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 not really, not really. No, I've been giving some apples, um, crackers, ginger. Yeah, ginger, 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 ginger. Oh. Yeah, ginger with a little warm water. He helped a lot. He it helped. Helps. Yeah, he helped. Yeah. <laughs> He's all about making sure that everyone's trip is amazing and and you don't have to feel unwell. He knows all the secrets to seasickness. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, great, great. People oh. having great time here. People having and great time. How long have you been on on this ship? Oh, in this ship, almost almost three months. Almost oh. three months, but working in the cruise ship industry, thirty years. Thirty, yeah. Oh my gosh! All right, that's that's a long time, yes, peeps. Yes. Um. Oh. Okay. So with Royal the whole time? All time with Royal Caribbean. All time. Oh my all gosh! Time. Traveling that's around amazing. the world. First time in Australia, and I love it. I love it. Yeah. I love it. Really, I Australia love it. Australia is Really, amazing. really great people. Great people. Oh Morning. my gosh! Um, so, yeah. what was the ship before mm. Ovation? Before Ovation, Adventure of the Seas. Adventure yeah, of the Seas. Adventure, seas. sailing from New York. Oh, uh, I fun, love fun, New York. Fun, 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 fun. Awesome. <laughs> fun, oh. fun. Oh wow, you've seen a lot of the world in. A lot, a lot. Like Europe, all yeah. of it. Almost, almost, all over, almost, almost. That's amazing. Yes, yes. Oh I my miss God. Few places. I miss few places, but I'm sure I'm gonna reach there. <laughs> You've got that last little bit of your bucket list to tick off. Right? Is that in the bucket list? It's like a uh, tiny, yeah. tiny, tiny portion. Tiny portion, tiny. Oh, Singapore, amazing. Singapore, very soon, I think so next year. Singapore? Singapore, I think so next oh, year. Oh, and yeah. you're so yeah, close yeah. because Australia is close to <laughs> Singapore, close, right? Yeah, yeah, I think so next year I go wow. there. Next year, for sure, for sure. Oh, uh, well, Jose, no, thank you so much no. for taking some time to talk to us today. No, pleasure, pleasure. Always, always a pleasure. Oh, thank right, you so yeah. much. We love Royal Caribbean and we love Ovation of the Seas. Right. We have enjoyed every moment of it so far and, and your restaurant yeah. is beautiful and your staff are yeah. beautiful yeah. and the food is food. Food food is beautiful as well. Great. So thank you so much. No, thank you, thank, thank you, thank you. And now we are headed to 270 again for the 70s party. I've learned all the dance moves that I can thanks to the training class that we had early in the afternoon. And I've got what I can come up with as a 70s outfit. I feel like I'm, I'm kind of looking a little bit 70s and I'm very excited for some 70s dancing, some 70s music and get my 70s on. 